This is me using a flip phone and living a peaceful life in 2023. After being in the rat race for cell phones and the insane control they had over my life. Hello YouTube. This is my cat, the Cat Flip S22. Been using the Cat phone now for almost 6 months after being an iPhone and an Android user for almost 10 years and been shifting between pieces of glass. This shift has been very life changing for me and for some more context I will have to take you guys back in time. So just like every one of you, I uninstalled Instagram thinking that that would help stop the endless scrolling. But soon did I realize that that did not help because I still kept reaching to my phone and found my mind finding other ways to give me dopamine like browsing for new products or googling the randomest stuff. And also since I had left Instagram my friends now kept sending me memes and reels on WhatsApp and I had to watch them on my phone browser This is when I started looking for a dumb phone around me and my main criteria was it had to have all the important apps like WhatsApp and Google Maps and also banking apps so it had to run on a good operating system and i also did not want a big glass slab on my face that's when i found the cat s22 flip you should be able to pick one up for as low as 70 dollars in the us cat is the same brand that makes this so it's built like a tank and also feels like it's made of vibranium before you ask me if it runs specific apps this phone runs on android 11 just like every other android phone in your pocket right now just a bit slower so every app available on the play store can be downloaded on this device these were sold back in 2021 as t mobile exclusives in the us but now you can buy one all around the world as an unlocked version so just make sure to check the settings of your phone if it's unlocked otherwise it wouldn't work in your country I have been using my Airtel SIM over here in India and it's been working flawlessly. My favorite part hands down is the mini touch screen. It's a weird combination of being easy to use and also being extremely restrictive at the same time. It's still easy to give quick replies to people thanks to the Google swipe keyboard. but it is also close to impossible to engage in a fast conversation cat has definitely hit the sweet spot for a dumb phone screen i also found out that the traditional posture while using a smartphone is extremely horrible for your neck but because of the angle of the flip screen you do not have to actually bend your neck as much the camera again is not the best but does the job the stability is fine but there is no comparison to modern day phones the camera on this gives me nostalgia of clicking pictures back in the day on my ipod touch the only drawback i found after getting this phone is that you are going to turn into a little anti social person and also receive a lot of hate from your friends and family for not replying to their messages this might sound a little crazy but my screen time on my iphone before i got the cat was approximately 7 hours per day which is barely an hour now after i got the cat this is the longest i've been looking at my screen to record this video with my iphone so a like and subscribe would really be nice this phone has helped me concentrate on the content i'm watching It keeps me focused on the video because there is no actual space to scroll down and look at other videos and also keep me away from the shorts and reels stopping me from that endless scrolling. There's also this cool little action button that comes with every cat phone and is finally now available on the iPhone 15. I use this as my torch light and it feels really cool. to not have to use a screen just to turn on the torch still confused about the cat s22 flip put it down in the comments and i'll have them answered for you also looking forward to listen to your digital minimalism journey
Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.